right. <laughs> oh, wow. What is up, early game? Early, early game. How we doing? Your boy is tired. I am plum exhausted. I am positively zonked, my dudes. Um, I've been moving, moving, moving like nobody's business. Going and driving and doing. I am just pulling on two wheels. Um, we'll plan on going until 9.30 tonight since I got in here a little late. Um, if I can stay awake that long. <laughs> 9.30. At 9.30, I will have been awake for... That's not right. 17 hours? I will have been awake for 17 hours at, at 9. Oof. All right, we are live at chat. Come help us figure out what to play. Dope. Dope. Whew. I mean, seriously, though, coming in on two wheels. Um, we did have a power outage today. So there's really no telling how today's stream will go. Um, we may just lose power. Or not power, but we may just lose the internet. And that is just going to be fine. What's up, trombone? T-bone. You have not been able to join us in a while. You've been so busy. Work, work, work. Well, we're excited for you, trombone. Excited for work. Excited to be busy. It's a good thing. It's a good thing. How we doing? Uh, we got to figure out what we want to play tonight. We've got to figure out what we want to play. Still at the dealership. Yay, work! Yay! Woohoo! Everybody loves work, right? Everybody's favorite thing. Why don't we start out with some marbles? It's been a while since we played marbles. Which means I'm limited by my game together options. Oh yeah. Mm-hmm. Love it. Woo. It's been a while. Been a while. Miss Eileen Valentine, what's up? Welcome to the stream. Happy that you're here. Welcome in, welcome in. Eileen Valentine, you hang on. Let's see what you have. Cause I don't know. So you got to spin the sub wheel during our Y Checkpoint Church event. But I gotta try and find where all the redemptions. There we go, the gotcha results. We can do yours now if you're if you're if you're here. So if I can find your name. Ah! It's a doodle request! Do you have something you'd like to see me doodle in 90 seconds? Anything will do. A little dab will do ya. Jate, how are you doing tonight? How are things going? Are you in the midst of a stream right now or are you about to queue it up? What you what you got going down? Yeah, that was your and I need to I need to I need to check it off and say that I've done it. So if you've got to do a request, let me know. Boink. You want it for free. For free. Man, it's really it's patching up marbles. These marbles need need big patches. Pizza, you got it. I actually had pizza for dinner tonight, so it's very appropriate. All right. Pizza it is. Okay, Google, 90 seconds on the clock. It's gonna be pepperoni. Pepperoni was what I had. That's what I was feeling. Some pepperones are a little bigger than others. I'm gonna try and do the uh, the drippy the drippy cheese. It's a deep dish. It's a deep dish, by the way. It's a deep dish. 
I always like whenever it looks more, it, it's looking more and more like apple pie. What's up, emo? Um, if I jump on and play anything with y'all, you need to not mention me leaving the dealership once I have you on audio because I wasn't able to let them know yet. Complicated for working on it, that, putting in my two weeks today. Got you, got you, got you, got you. So you're doing that at the end of the day today. Uh, let's see what, uh, this is, this is, I mean, this is my pizza. This is my pizza. I drew my pizza and 40 seconds left on the clock and I've just, I've just done it. All right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do some, some smell lines going off of it. Um, so typically I feel like the fly floating around the thing seems to connote that it smells bad, but flies float around things that smell good. <laughs> and I don't want to do that. Uh, let's see, I'm gonna draw a little me in the background and he's still, he's still, He's still hungry for it. Since I did have it tonight. He's gonna be, he's gonna be in love with the pizza. He's gonna be doing that like floaty. Oh, I didn't get to finish the floaty, so I'm just a piece of bacon. All right. There you go. Ooh, ooh, ooh. There we go. There's that beautiful slice of pie. It really does look like a pie. That is as deep a dish as you've ever seen. As deep a dish, and that's me, a piece of bacon floating in from the side. There we go. There we go, there we go. Two gotch buns, you got it. You got it. Let's make it happen. Will the Z fighters manage to defeat Cell before he opens a gotch chop bun? Ah, uh, you could Find say, damn it, baby, Dragon Ball Z. Supporting now. And I do another gotch chop bun, please. All right, first off, we got trombone. T-bone. T-bone. Read a page out of my book. Read Nate's book. Okay, you know what it says. Read Nate's book, trombone, your favorite thing. Of course you would get that. Uh, let's see, doing all right, just chilling, but it's in the queue for sure. Got you, got you, got you. Jade, I played a game that I think you would enjoy. It's very cute and fun. But it does cost the money, and that is always the issue, that they do cost the money. But I'm really enjoying this game called Islets right now. I played it on stream. Ah! Rain, you got beans. Can you wait to read the book? I want to be able to experience it. Just don't let me forget. Right or left, Rain? Right or left? Jake is the master of eating these beans, by the way. Yikes, that was like a minute and a half of ads. Yeah, I queued them up specifically for Rain Plus Cat. I asked them to make sure Rain Plus Cat in particular got so many ads. Right it is. All right, here we go. Um, what bean flavor is it? What bean flavor is this one? I can't even tell. Maybe stink bug? I think this might be, this might be. They're easy peasy now. Yeah, not for me. I've had so many of them. I've not had as many as you, but I have had a lot of them and they have gotten literally no easier. Bottoms up. Stink bug. Yep. I don't know how you finish them, dude. Not a chance. Not a shot am I gonna be finishing one of those beans. But that is getting better. It's getting better. It just kind of tastes like a trash bag. NPM, we need to find you a designated adult for LTN Gone. Uh, agreed. Let's play some marbles. Let's play some marbles. If I can remember, that's that's the thing. Okay. You spit them out, then how do you gain their powers? I I choose not to have the powers. I choose no powers. How do I start the how do I start it? How do I start it? Start, 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 start! Random. Race. I am going to LTN Con. I will be there. I'm hosting two events. Uh oh. Uh oh. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, there we go. Okay. Excam exclamation point play. Exclamation point play. Countdown is going to be uh, 180 seconds. We're going to do three minutes. Trace minutes, that's so many minutes, but you know, we'll chat, we'll chat for a little bit. First race is up though, exclamation point play. Since we got people coming in at the beginning here, enter in, have fun, let's get into this. We don't have anything fun like LTN where we, we give out fun channel points, but that would be a good idea. Would be a good idea. 
They asked me, but I couldn't make it work this time. No! Next time for sure. Bummer. Well, I'll plan to go next year. I have all of my syllabuses now. Syllabi? Is it syllabuses or syllabi? Why is nobody... Okay, I definitely see... I see... There are definitely some marbles in here. Okay. Um... All my syllabi for my classes, so now I can see how busy I'm gonna be. Rain, my best piece of advice I can give you for seminary syllabi is whatever reading they recommend, just go ahead and start now. Don't wait until they assign a reading because there are so many books that truthfully, just go ahead and start them now. MPN, we have decided next year for LTN Con, you'll be my designated adult. Is that right? I don't know. I'm hard to keep up with. I'm all over the place. Uh, that's not actually that true. I'm either hard to keep up with or I am um, in a corner somewhere trying my best to not have anyone talk to me. As much as I love you nerds, even whenever I, uh, even whenever I know the people that I'm with, if, there, if there's too many people there, I'm, gonna, I'm going to turn into a clam. I'm going to clam up very much. My introversion scale is off the charts. Three minutes is too long. Next time we're gonna do 90 seconds. Three minutes is far too long. Far too long. We're gonna figure out we're gonna to play tonight, folks. Trying to get myself ready for the weekend. I'll have to record several vo vocals. I've been procrastinating on them for so long. If I can get myself to recording Demise, my enormous project is gonna finally be done. Oh, what a wonderful feeling. I, so I saw that comment earlier about Demise. And I thought you said Delmi's like the Pokemon, and I was tickled that you had a song named after a Pokemon's. Let's see, a normal project. I use the last mixer channel in FL Studio. There's 125 plus the master in total. Holy moly! That's so many channels! If I bring the candle business out, I'm gonna stay at the booth all day. All right, I feel like LTN Con is one con where you can't just stay at the booth, you know? There's too much going on. Too much happening. Too much everywhere, every which away. But we'll see if LTN Con remains to be, because I know God Squad also does a God Squad Con, and there's no promise the Checkpoint Church won't have a con next year. Who could say? Who could say? It's not on the charts yet. It's not on the calendar. And so since it's not on the calendar, probably not next year, but who could say? Who could say? I wish I could go to LTN Con. Once they go to the, well, you're not, are you UK? Are you, are you, you're not UK. You are definitely on the other side of the pond, but you are not in the UK. I don't know what the UK is. Uh, true, especially when there's food. God Squad has been staying online for Squad Con. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Three, two, one, here we go! Moment is here! Trombones leading the pack. I've never done this one. Factory. Jake Con is gonna be just Jake, and it's in Japan, and it's not listed anywhere. That sounds really wonderful. No, not UK, Hungary. Yes. I feel like I wanted to say Hungary anyway, but truthfully, um, if you guys have never gone back and watched any of our, like, checkathons, it is really shocking just how little I know um, about this world. DuckCon will be in your basement. Wink. Wink, wink. I do have a dream. I do have a dream, Jay. You let me know when you go to Japan because I need to go to Japan in the next two years. I always told my wife that I would go before I turned 30 and I'm 28. So I got, I got two years. May, May 29th of 2024. If I've not been to Japan by then, I don't know what I'm gonna do, emotionally. I oh, mean, we gotta go back with trombone. This is, this, is a, this is a wild one, huh? Boom tubes. I already went, but I'll go again with you. That sounds good to me. I'm only 20, I'm very young. I keep telling people that I'm very young. Raincon is during the hurricane season. Appropriate, appropriate indeed. I'm very young, I'm a child, I'm an infant, no one believes me. I mean, I'm barely a millennial. It's not true, I'm pretty well established. Our millennial is like 1997, so I got three years, I got three years on me. Raven Rook, I feel so old now, now you know. I just give off the vibe of being much older. Weird to me that you're younger than I am. I'm very young, I'm very young, I'm very, I'm a child. I just give off a, the vibe of an old person. My wife and I are both like that. I think that's something that we bonded on is because we both have always had older friends. But yes, I always said, my wife has literally no interest in going to Japan, but I've always said before I turn 30, I'm going to Japan. Diagne of it. It's happening. Oh no, rain, you're stuck. 
It's weird to me that you're only seven years older than me. What I think really weirds people out is when they realize that I have a la bebe. I have two la bebes. I have a I have a la bebe that is going to school before too long, and I'm not okay with that. I'm so old. Oh no! Oh no! Oh, packaging! <whistles> Yay! In the packing peanuts rain. Chats in the clap for rain plus cat. You did Japan before you were thirty. I'm old, just turned 40 this month. Now, I will say about Rain Plus Cat, folks, if you've never joined him on stream, there is literally no way you would ever guess that Rain Plus Cat is 40 because Rain Plus Cat is, uh, is truthfully so young. So young and spirited. I want to surprise Frostbite so badly with showing up to LTN Con. Also, it would be a really interesting experience. I've been on foreign lands only once for a few hours. We visited a castle in Austria near the Hungarian border. That's pretty cool, though. <laughs> That's a pretty cool thing to say. Is that a cool thing to say, or are there, like, so many castles once you get anywhere other than America? Do. Man, this, this course, you really get stuck a lot, huh? Whoop. Packaged. Looky there, let's go, Mr. Marbles. And we got the top three on the course, Rain Plus Cat, bringing it in with the front of the line, Trombo Dollar coming close behind. Ooh, did you hear that feedback? That was nice. Smooth, authentic feedback. There are a lot of castles in Europe, that's what I've been told. Miss Eileen Valentine says I'm 33. That's a great age. Three threes. Very nice. Three threes in the chat. Splash Force Gaming. Hello. Welcome, welcome. All right, let's go for another one, yeah? Random track. Congratulations to our winners. I'm now quoting two, two castles right now, both over 7,000 square feet. Interesting. Is that kind of like that thing where you... Um... All right, we're going to take it down to 90 seconds. 90 seconds on the clock. Countdown starting. Exclamation point play. Get your marbles in, folks. 90 seconds on the clock. Uh, is that kind of like the thing where you buy like a square footage of a castle, a single square foot, so that you can become a lord and lady? I'm 23, I kind of look like I'm 25 with my current hair and beard cut. If I shave, I look like 17. On Sunday, my classmate took a photo of me. On that picture, I look like 40. You are an enigma. You're an enigma, Emo. They're, they're just giant houses on the lake. I love it. I mean, is there anything in Europe besides castles? Sarcasm. Well, Emo, it would be great to meet everybody. I think it's so fascinating to me, all these, all these folks. All these folks, and you all know each other. It's wonderful. I'm looking forward to an opportunity to get to meet up with everybody. It's right around the corner. It's right around the corner. You guys want to see something adorable? This is the reason why I was late tonight. See if I can pull it up. I was 30 minutes late tonight because of, oh no, did I not save it? I totally did, there it is. Because my baby girl had her first dance class. Look at this little baby. She did so good. She did so good, look at her, she's adorable. She's the cutest baby there's ever been. That's Nora. And she, um, she did a great job at her dance class tonight. Whee. It's the cutest. She's the cutest baby there's ever been. Except for my second baby, which is, of course, also the cutest baby there's ever been. But she, uh, she had her dance class tonight. Your first niece's name is Nora. Nora's a great name. Nora's a great name. We, we cursed her for life because it is N-O-R-A-H with this Nora. So we did the weird spelling. And then she also has the middle name Jane after my grandmother. And my grandmother's middle name Jane was spelled J-A-Y-N-E. So she is Nora, N-O-R-A-H, J-A-Y-N-E. Isn't that evil? Isn't that evil of us? We did that to her. We cursed her with that name. Did you at least get out and dance? No, they wouldn't let me in. So they straight up, um, this dance studio during COVID 
They closed their waiting room because they didn't want parents waiting in the waiting room with COVID stuff going on. And then they found out that they liked not having the parents that much. <laughs> that now they just don't let the parents stay. So once you drop off your kiddo, you got to leave. And I think that's hysterical. But we do. We were practicing dancing the night before. If I would have been four more female, I would have been Nora. Nora in Hungarian, but I'm male, so I'm Mate. Matta? Uh, Mata? I don't know. I don't know, dude. I took I took uh, diction, but I never took Hungarian diction. I took German diction, Italian diction. She will never have a custom keychain unless it's in the Nora Jones, um, Nora Jones Museum. Personally, significantly more attached to Max than Eddie. Where did this happen? I watched Stranger Things the other day and I still don't know what to do it myself. I might still be mourning Eddie, said uh, Raven Rock. Spoilers! Spoilers in the chat! You like Max more than Eddie? Yeah, I mean, I think that um, I really don't like what they did to Eddie. It wasn't very fun. Hey! First in line, coming out of lane is Jake Life. Oh, hopefully the ring will scat. And then bringing up third is Miss Eileen Valentine. Congratulations to our first, second, and third winner. German pronunciation is kind of close to Hungarian. This was also 10 years ago that I took this class. Congratulations to Jay. Chats in the clap. You get all the chats in the clap that you want, Jay. That's where we'll send. We'll send all of the chats in the clap to your PayPal. Another one. Another one. We'll go to like seven with some, with some marbles. All right, 90 seconds on the clock. I did realize I've not been typing play, so we could have had a we could have had a whole other player all these rounds. There we go. There we go. Oh man! So the issue with playing anything on the Switch is that I still have Digimon Survive up from the other day because I never finished that battle because I got so mad. And uh, I have a join button. That's hilarious. I didn't even realize that. That's very funny. You guys are so smart. You guys are so so smart. I feel like uh, I learn so much from people that are on Twitch that I truly just do not know. If I would have been born female, I would have been Darian, but I was born male, so it is Darian. There you go. Oh, I see, E instead of A. Very funny. You have a cousin named Darian with two R's. Fascinating. I was going to be named Nathan. I am named Nathan. Or I would have been named Jody Bell. And since... Uh, since they had a boy, they named the dog Jody Bell. Jody Bell is now passed on, and it's very sad. But we grew up, literally like like a couple months after I was born, we bought, bought oh gosh, <laughs> that's terrible. We, we adopted, oh man. I get, I get so much, I get so much garbage for my, my takes on dogs here. We adopted a dog, and we named her Jody. Maybe they bought her, I don't know. She was a, she was a Pekingese, should sue. We called her a Pikachu. It's a little on the nose. Mary Pastor Nate didn't know Discord channels have a description until I told him. I seriously did not, and I'm so embarrassed about it. Let's be honest, you bought a dog. I mean, that's true. Oh, I didn't. I did not buy Ollie. Our current dog was very much given to me against my better interests and wishes. That awful dog. Oh man, it just keeps, everybody keeps going to number one. Splash. All right, now we're following Splash. Love it. VIP, look at that beautiful VIP sub badge. I didn't know that happened on marbles. That's very nice. I didn't know you were a VIP. Did you win it? Maybe you got it in the sub wheel. I ate dinner tonight. We love when people eat dinner. Is Nathan a kind of transistor? Is that why you call him NPM? Nerd Pastor Nate. A fun little shortening of my name. But I could be a transistor if you guys want me to. I treated myself to DoorDash of a burrito plus queso. Oh, that sounds amazing, dude. There is truly no food like Mexican food. That, that is my favorite food by far. You got it from the sub wheel, that's it. Um, there is there is nothing I enjoy as much as Mexican food. Truthfully, 
you never know. It is the best, the best Jean. Jean! Was it only $35? That sounds joyous. Joyous indeed. Burrito. We had a really good um, enchilada this week. It was excellent. So, Nate, are you sure your true name isn't Nathaniel? No, it's truly not. It is Nathan. Uh, and I think the only reason that they didn't name me Nathaniel is because my brother's name is Daniel. And so they couldn't do Daniel and Nathaniel. That just wouldn't work, you know? $27. That's a very expensive burrito. Holy moly. Where did you order from? Is that Zelda that I hear? It is indeed. Let's see which one it is in particular. Whoa, never mind. I'm still checked in that box. Oh, I didn't even call that. I didn't even. And Splash Wars Gaming coming, coming in front. front. Followed Follow him closely, closely, or not closely, closely quite, quite loosely, loosely, in fact, behind by, by Checkpoint, Checkpoint Church. Church. And then in third, we have Trombone Dolly Green in the third. If he gets in trouble, say Nathaniel. No, it's truly not, though. It's truly not. Okay, now I can click over. Let's see what this is. Fies farewell. Fies farewell. Whoop. Whoop. Crazy expensive for just one person. That is so interesting. You guys have got to find better DoorDash places. I never spend more than $15 at DoorDash. And that includes tip. Got to find the right spot to the right price. All right, 90 seconds on the clock. Exclamation point play in the chat to enter in for your chance to win absolutely nothing except for credit. You deliver for DoorDash instead. So as a deliverer for DoorDash, do you get credits? Still, I can get a mail for like six to seven from fast food. Yep, 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 yep. Gonna go eat some chicken broth, because why not? And by that, I mean drink it. That's what thermoses are for. Nope, you get nothing. You just get, you get whatever, $2. Don't they pay something insanely low? I feel like I remember that. Maybe it was Uber. I hate it, man. I try to tip well. I try to. We actually got free food tonight. We got bonus food. Extra food. And I feel really bad. <laughs> but once they put it down, it's like, well, they can't take it back. But they accidentally delivered two people's orders to us. So, including ours. So, one extra order. So, we got an extra order of food but I feel real bad for our DoorDash driver. I'll pay you with candles. Candles are the best payment. Don't forget that exclamation point play in the chat. 14 seconds. 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 Yeah, horoscope, try it. Exclamation point horoscope. See what your see what your horoscope of the day is. It looks like emotes is a, uh, or, or uh, trombones is a flaming head shooting to the left. Everybody has their own horoscope of the day. Yeah, that would definitely be a nightmare for me. Are you talking about leaving the leaving the second person's food? I felt so bad, dude. But it's like, what you gonna do? What you gonna do? I can't do anything. There's nothing I can offer them at this point. I can't give them the food back. It's that map, these rotating things aren't centered. Oh, that's awful. We need to do some of uh, Alice's maps. Now that I know that Alice makes maps. I'd pay for the food if it was that easy, but it's the headache of trying to figure it out, right? Nightmare, dude. The axis of rotation isn't centered. Well, thankfully we're past it now. Oh man, rain is booking it, dude. Rain, how have your streams been? How are you, by the way? Are you are you are you finally back to normal, my friend? You've sounded so rough for weeks. I hope that you're back you're back to your fighting self. Feeling good and energized. Cause I know that was really at the height of everything with the with the fall guys turning, and that was a while ago, but I hope you're doing alright. Hope you're doing alright. We gonna be all right. 
I mean, Rain is stuck again. This is rough. This is rough, dude. What are we gonna do? What are we gonna do? What could be done? Oh, yeah. Nicely done. Masterclass. Who will, Who will finish, finish this, this map? map. We've, got We've got four, four DNFs, DNFs so far. So far. Rain, Rain, Emo, and Jade are the only three remaining in the round. Oh, Rain pulls ahead just in time. Looks like he's gonna pull through with that first place position. Emo and Jade are now battling for second. Who's gonna take it? It looks like Emo's coming ahead. And there we go. Jade is still... <laughs> oh no! Jade is still back here with the pillars. That's all right. What is, who is that ball up there? Who is that mystery ball? Who's the mystery ball? <laughs> Who's that? <laughs> What's happening? Did we just glitch out? Interesting. Very, very strange. Very, very strange. Jade, are you still playing Tower of Fantasy? I feel like I haven't been able to hop on your streams in a bit. A ghost from a previous match. Oh, got you. Learning, learning, learning. Excellent job. Chats in the clap for the top three. We'll do one more. Unamas, the last race, the final race. This echo effect gives me so much Cave Johnson vibe in the old aperture testing spheres. Whenever you said Cave Johnson, yeah, I combined two musical artists in my head. Right now, I'm obsessed on TikTok with Spilly Cave. If you've not heard of Spilly Cave, he looks just like my buddy AJ from college, and it trips me out every single time. And um, and then Hobo Johnson. Spilly Cave, Hobo Johnson, Cave Johnson. Definitely what I thought you were saying. Folks, this is the final countdown. This is the one. If you want to do it, be sure to do it right now. Not enough content to play it super regularly. Oh, you said you were playing it for Weeb Wednesday. Got you, got you, got you. Yeah, I feel like uh, you're you're catching up to it so quick. Yeah. Is that a is that the same way that it was with Genshin? Was it also a slow build where you had to kind of wait for things to build up, or is it just that you are the avid gamer that you are? I like that this is our last race. This is very nice. Genshin was the same. I know nothing about any of those games. I've now played precisely an hour of Genshin and precisely an hour of um, Tower of Fantasy. Panda mug or flower mug? I vote uh, Panda. I'm voting Panda tonight. Talking about the founder of Aperture Science and the Half-Life and Portal franchise. Yes, yes, yes. I figured that out once you said Aperture, but my first thought whenever I saw Cave Johnson was certainly Spilly Cave plus Hobo Johnson. All right, we got a fiver this round. Anybody can take it. Only two will lose, unless we have some DNFs. This is this will forever be my favorite song in here. I love the birds. Bird song. I always love it whenever it comes on Jate streams too. Anytime I'm in the background and I hear this one start happening, I'm like, perfect. Have I ever told you about the panda that is attached to me, also known as a panda tattoo? I did see a tattoo of yours today, Duck Makes Things. I think I saw on uh, Twitter that you had a Judas 8-2 tattoo. Very cool. Very cool stuff. You guys, we gotta, we gotta find something to play. What are we playing? I should have been playing Did You Want Survive this whole time. Should we delve in? It's been so long since I've delved into the Minecraft server. We could always do that. I know Splash wanted to play that. I don't know if you're still here, Splash. But we could we could delve into the realm. I kind of have a hankering. I still want to build that treehouse. Three little words that have so much meaning. Absolutely. Those are the best, aren't they? Those are the best. Am I too far away from the microphone? I feel like I might have been. I feel like I might have been a little too far away there. I just get so, I get so chill. You guys have done okay on my water today. I've not done fantastic, but I've done okay. I'm at, I'm at almost 4 p.m. And I feel like that's, that's pretty good. That's pretty good for me. 
Man, a lot of DNFs. A whole lot of DNFs. Am I gonna am I gonna take it on my own last one? <laughs> no! I don't wanna win my own last one. Please, Raven Rook. Make it happen, Cap'n. Just got yeeted. Point, point. No! <laughs> Man! I'm the only one that remains! Oh, and I might I might DNF too. Minecraft, I have so many things to do code-related. I'm a dev for a server, but I'm mostly out of energy for making progress. Oof. I am extremely new to the world of Minecraft, and I still know very little, and so I just enjoy it very innocently and naively. Because I know quite literally nothing. What's up, Kuro? How are we doing? I added your game to uh, a wish list today. Woo, that was a close one. Can anyone else seeing Jate live adding a ukulele to his stream? I don't know what instruments uh, Jate plays. Hydrate! Cheers. Congratulations to myself on that one. I won my own race. Go me! Go me. I'm the best me that I've ever been. You ain't never had a friend. All right, how do I quit this game? I always forget. Race menu. Yee. Yeah. Quit. Rigged. It is pretty, it is pretty bizarre. <laughs> it is pretty bizarre that that would be what happens. But yes, Kuro, I added, um, I added uh, Rogue Legacy. Raid Shadow Rogue Legends. Added that to my wish list. I also added one shot to my wish list, so now I have both of those on there. But I did just start playing Islets, and I have another one on the backlog before that. So we'll get to them. We'll get to them. We'll get to them. I've also been very tempted to play some um, One Shot Was So Good. Yes, you recommended it to me, and I gotta play it. I gotta play it. Got to. If it's a game, whenever I Google a game and it says, like, compare to Undertale and Amori, I'm like, yeah. Yeah, that's going to be for me. Aw, gift. Aw, Kuro. Well, sure, I'll accept it. Of course. Thank you so much. Danka. Very cool. I will download it. I will download that and play that very soon. Sooner, very soon. It's fun. Yeah, I'm looking forward to it. Got chop on. You got it. Who is your daddy? Does he got chop on? Let's Does get he? to the gut chop on. Does he got chop on? Get to the gut chop on. I added two in there first. No need to play the first, the second's better. One of those. I appreciate you telling me that because I absolutely would have tried to play them in order and that would have been a bummer. Alright, email, you got a You got a 12-sided die. The way that the 12-sided die works. What's the possibility of playing Unite tonight? I'm down. I haven't updated it in like a year, but I'm totally down to play Unite. Um, especially if we can get a crew of five together. 12-sided uh, die, if I get a nat crit, then I get to pick a game to play for a bonus stream. If I get a, a nat fail, you get to pick a game. Anything else, it doesn't matter. It has to be a nat, and it's gotta be a crit. Crit fail or... Ooh, it's a three. So close. So close. And I do have all sizes of die in there, so the odds do go very differently depending on which one you get. Uh, got chop on. You got it. Get next time. Sonic. But first we must got chop on. Ooh, you got Robotnik. That's a very rare one. I don't I don't hear a lot of Robotnik. Jake. You got the boulder badge. Boulder badge, my friend. Ooh, hang on. There we go. Whenever you collect all eight badges, whoever gets the eighth badge. Isn't that a dodecahedron? I wouldn't even know. Is that what the 12-sided die is? Maybe. Whoever collects the eighth Pokemon badge gets to send me a tier maker of their choosing that I'll complete on stream. That sounds right, dodeca. The biblioteca. Hey, that's very appropriate, Jay. You got a boulder badge, and that's our first badge that we've collected. That's very fun. That's very fun. If we collect them in order, I don't know what I would do, but that's very neat. Scratch the Unite request because I don't have a charger. Oh, no! 
And you can't stumble upon a, a USB-C somewhere, huh? That's not one you stumble on often. I swear, I'll just be walking down the street and I'll find a USB-A. Or a USB micro. I'll find them everywhere. But the odds of me finding USB-C? Another Arnold Schwarzenegger tonight. How about that? Emo, I specially ordered this candy machine from a candy machine company. And it was way more than I wanted to spend. But we have made good use of it. Beans! Jake. It's the nasty beans, the barf beam. Right or left? Right or left? I love this redemption. I might steal, I mean borrow this idea. Please do. Please take this idea. It's real fun. It's real fun. I love the gotcha pond machine. And I just had, um, in case you can't tell, which I'm certain that you can, um, I just had a, uh, uh, what are they called? AI. An AI voice do all these. Left. Here we go. Can we get two in a row nasty? You know we can. You know we can. Barf bean. Bottoms up. Peach. Mm. Oh yeah. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. Mm. No, strawberry banana, don't care. Peach, I don't, I don't care what it is. It's a winner. Chats in the clap for no nasty bean. Mm. Delicious. You want peach? Peach does sound good. what I do with the other bean? I throw it away. I should probably put it back in the box. That would make way more sense and be way less wasteful. So I'll put them in the box. <laughs> I honestly hadn't thought about it until you said anything about it. So this is our machine here. It's a very nice machine. It's very fancy. It's very heavy. Very heavy. Um, let's see. I'll see if I can show you guys. Oh man, I'm gonna have to mess everything up, aren't I? Oh yeah, yeah, I'm about, to, I'm about to unplug everything. And I can't lift it, that's for sure. Unless I can. Uh, nope. That ain't going anywhere. It's a very nice machine. Very fancy. Um, it's actually kind of fun. It, it makes me excited to like know how the things work now that I have one. And at least this one in particular, whenever you lift the glass up, this opens, and that's where you get your quarters from. So I can show you guys. So like, open up that part. When you do, this little section right here, you guys can kind of see it at the bottom of the screen. Oh, I know what I can do. Ooh, 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 ooh. Let's go right here. Let's go down, down, down. Yeah! So you guys can see right here, right? This opens right up. And right here are my quarters. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. And then there's your little gachapon coin there. It's very nice. And then when we need more quarters, you free stock. We put them back in the Pokeball. We call it a day. Woo! We seal it up. We try not to break everything that we have. And then we want to seal back up, lift it up, boom. It's almost scary how easy it is to do. Yeah, I do kind of love that. They're all over Japan. That's the part of the reason why I love it. I just love calling them gachapons. I'm sure that most people would call them just a candy machine, but the fact that I call them a gotcha pun makes it real fun. It is very tricky to try and get a avatar, uh, like an auto-generated um, voice to say gotcha pun. My trick, you will start to hear it now, so this plug your ears if you don't want to hear my trick, but my trick is got chop on, because it always knows those three words, and so they always say got chop on, got chop on. This time on Dragon Ball Z, it's time to got chop on. Got chop on. So now you're never gonna unhear it. Sorry, I cursed you. Uh -oh. Now what have I done? Oh no! I've cursed it. I showed you guys the inside of the machine, and now it's embarrassed. Very lucky, very, very lucky, Jay. You got a new die. This is one I haven't done before uh, on stream. It is, a, it is a die inside of a die. So what I will do is I am going to do this. Uh, I don't know what it's gonna land on. No clue what it's gonna land on. Same rules, nap. And um, I don't have anything special for if both of them happen, but you get two chances and I also get two chances. So, 
Two chances at a D6. Let's find out if the magic, how is you like that? Is that some nice ASMR there? That's nice. Oh man, two chances and nothing. Got a three and a four. Three on the inside, four on the outside. I'll see if I can show it without messing it up. Mmm, bummer. Bummer, bummer, but this is a fun little die. It's a fun one. I like it. I like it. Another Gachapon. Jade's going crazy. Jay is loving the Gachapon. When standing knew that he was about to receive something unknown from the Gachapon machine. And that's all good. I love that you guys are loving it. You're kidding me. Okay. I thought it said gotcha and I got real excited because I was like, another one? You got a Gamba. Um, a Gamba is a chance to win more channel points. So, the way we do this. I have a game called Do You Know Me? We changed it to Do You Know Nate? It is gonna be a yes or no question about something that Nate has done or not done. And we will do a prediction for the answer. And you can bet as many channel points as you want to, so try and make it big. Try and get those channel points. Rack them up. Um, and I gotta go over to Creator Dashboard to cue a prediction. Excuse me. Get on over there. Do, 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 do. All right. Okay. So this is one that we won't know till we know. Uh, but I will try it once we guess yes or no. Can Nerd Pastor Nate name five types of flowers? Okay. One minute on the clock. Make your predictions. You have that game? Yeah, it's made by the what do you mean people. It's very fun. Some of the questions I skip. <laughs> Some of the questions I definitely skip. While we're waiting on that prediction and getting channel points in, I'm gonna do yours, Emo. Can we should have reverse time if we don't get what we want from the gotcha. Oh, thank you, Max Caulfield. A Dragon Ball! You guys are burning through my gotcha up on Uh, let's see, Emo, you got the one star Dragon Ball. Congratulations, my friend. One star Dragon Ball. Ooh, that's nice. Look at me upside down in there. Hello. Hi. It's me. Mario. Whenever all the Dragon Balls are got, whoever gets the seventh Dragon Ball and summon Shenron gets to decide a bonus stream for us. They always kind of go back to a bonus stream. And we got another Gamba right after it by Ravenrut. You got it. Three, two, one. Choose prediction outcome. Can Nerd Pastor Nate name five types of flower? Let's find out. Here we go. Pansy, Rose, Tulip, Lily, Forget Me Not. Isn't the Forget Me Not a flower? If not, then Baby's Breath. I think Forget Me Not is, is, is a flower. Let's Google Forget Me Not. I guess, I mean, I got it anyway, but. A genus, a genus of flowering plants. Yes. Yes. I did it. I named five types of flower. <laughs> Prediction answer was yes. Congratulations to the folks that took it home there. We're going to go for another prediction here. As you all know, Jesus drank wine, so we're allowed to answer this question. Does, oopsie, does Nerd Pastor Nate prefer white wine or red wine? White, red, one minute on the clock. Start prediction. It is nighttime. It is nighttime, so it feels like we're allowed to answer bevy questions, huh? Nerd Pastor Nate after dark. Oh yeah. yeah. Sun's gone. Sun's gone. Sun's gone. Gun's gone. gone. All right, get those points in. You guys could win big. You could win big. All you have to do is guess correctly, and you could win big. You could win the other people's points. As long as people vote on both sides, we got it. We got it unlocked. We got it down. Doom, doom, boop. Doom, 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 doom. Where is the whiskey option? Now that would that would be cheating because that would be the answer. I do love I do love a good whiskey. 
A good old fashioned. Sounds real nice. Three, two, one. Prediction outcome. Do I prefer white or red? Oh, that's funny. I spelled W H I N E. <laughs> uh, that was not a trick question. I accidentally typed an H, but the answer is red. The answer is indeed red. So, congratulations to our red wine winners. I like a nice, bold red. Nice, bold, dry red. Same way I like coffee. Boom, says Rain. Congratulations. Enjoy your channel points, my friend. Congratulations! Congratulations. Okay. Should we play some Minecraft? Should we play some craft? Should we get into the realm? It's been forever. It's been so, so long. Um, I haven't heard from Splash yet. Zando said Smash, Mario Kart, Among Us, Power Wash, or something. Perry said Unite, Minecraft, Ultimate, or Among Us. I picked red because communion. Very appropriate. Still missing 23k for VIP. You got this. Someone tell me, what's the deal with all of these got chop ons? I mean, come on. What's the deal, Jerry? What's the deal with all these got chop ons? You'll get there, Pineapple Pope. I believe in you. All right, Jake. You got a little Pac Man. So, you get to add a, uh, a retro stream. I'll play a retro game in an upcoming stream. And I'll go ahead and get my bonus stream book out. We've got we've got like 20 bonus streams lined up at this point. Who knows when they'll happen, but when they do, I'll play the game that you recommended, Jade. So you let me know what retro game you want to see me play. As far as retro goes, you go as far back as you want to. It doesn't really matter. I'll, I'll find a way to, to emulate it, worst case scenario. But typically I say like Wii back. Like Wii U is technically retro, but it's not. I don't want to do, I don't want to do Wii U. I like Wii. PS3, oh man, PS3 even feels too recent, doesn't it? Have to go for now, it's getting late over here. I mean, it's already late. Emo, I just appreciate you hanging at all, out at all, my friend. Thank you for being here. Appreciate you. God loves you, we love you, you matter. Always enjoy having folks around. I do think I, I think I stole Jate's idea with a bye. I feel like we have a goodbye. I think we have a bye-bye. If you want an exclamation point bye. We don't have a sleep, a good sleep, but we have an exclamation point bye. What I want to do is start having uh, sound effects. Because I love that. It's so charming. It's so charming. Love that stuff. Um, yeah, let's play some Minecraft. Let's get some, let's get some craft on. Let's get our craft on. Let's see what we can build. I still want to build a treehouse, dude. My favorite thing, my um, my guilty pleasure right now on TikTok is watching Minecraft builds and being like, oh, I'm gonna totally do that, and then never planning to do that. That's where I'm at right now. That's my place in life. All right. Is it updated? I guess we'll find out. I'd have to think a bit about retro. You let me know. You let me know. As long as I know. Wow, that looks very silly, doesn't it? We'll just center it. No, I like it better at the top. Do we really need the sides? Do we need the sides? Surely it'll be okay. Nobody will know. They're gonna know. How would they know? My Xbox controller is not connecting again. Why is this? I did this yesterday. Why? Why you do this to me? Why you do this to me? You come to my house. You refuse to connect. In my house. Nope. Come on. Oh, it's connected. Ah. But it's not though. But it's not though. <laughs> it's not though. It's not. It says it's connected, but it is indeed not connected. I can I can objectively see that this light. Oh, there we go. Stop. 
Yeah! Alright. Now we gotta decide what I'm gonna build today. That is the question. What do I wanna build? Hello, donkeys. El Burro. Ooh, it's a little, like, laggy. Alright. We'll be fine. I remember. I remember how to play this game. I definitely remember how to play this game. All right, I'm gonna go poop and lurk. Love ya. Bye, Jake. Thanks for hanging out with us. Appreciate ya. Appreciate you being here. Enjoy your lurk. Bathroom time is the best time, especially whenever you have two ankle biters, let me assure you. Oh yeah, I forgot about Buisha's map. Is that? That's his. Okay, so it doesn't reach. It doesn't quite reach my my expanse. It's been awesome. We checked on the church. Does anybody want to see the church? Let's go show it off. It's been a little while. It's been a while. What's up, pineapple? How we doing? I got a new skin on. Ooh, I want to see. It looks like, uh, looks to me like Steve. Looks just like Steve to me. Did it not take because of some kind of update or something? Um, what was I doing? Why was I going out? Oh, I remember. I'm gonna go hop in the, um, secret room. If anybody should choose to join me, they're welcome to. If you've requested to be given permit inside. Hmm. I wonder where you would go. I don't know if we'd be able to hear you in here or not. Yeah, it's not showing. I'm gonna say it'll play through here. I got no clue. Yep. You got nothing on. You're just a you're a classic Steve. The classicest. It's an import from Java. Weird. Weird, weird, weird. It's almost like they don't have this all figured out at this point yet. Look at all this stuff. You guys are so smart. You're so smart. You're so good at Minecraft. How are you all so good at Minecraft? Look at ya. Look at ya. You're geniuses. In the meantime, I'm doing absolutely nothing. Ooh, a fountain. Oh, that's very nice. Who made the fountain? Oh, I love this. Isn't that gorgeous? What a wonderful job. And what is this? Who's, who's, whose area is this now? Ooh, is that a spawner? What is happening here? Figure out what's going on here. Oh, it's hard to get through this tree. I need to eat something. Yo, what is this space? So today I had a seventh grade student walk up and ask me if they can use aluminum foil in the microwave. They were not prepared for how quick I responded. Not aluminum foil. It is metal. We do not put metal in the microwave. That was a good, a good quick response. Oh, I feel like I shouldn't. I feel like I shouldn't. I feel like this would. I feel like that's not going to go well. I feel like that's not going to go well. This has got to be. This has got to be like a spawner or something. Some kind of exp grinder or something. Some kind of death trap. Some kind of death trap, and I ain't falling for it. Not no way. Not no how. I need to change the game. That's what I was doing. Try and pause without dying. Where's Splash? Somebody at Splash. I always just love popping in and just checking on the church. Look at how good it looks. Look at how good it looks. Exceptional. Whose spot is this over here? Who's building a little military base over here? What's this all about? 
Yeah, I have I have made the fatal error of putting metal in the microwave before. That's like Mountain Doom over there. So deal with that. Ooh, what are you? Pretty horse. Oh my goodness. Somebody just had fun over here. And just build out of whatever they had, huh? I also had an eighth grade student ask me if he could fight someone. I said no. He said, what if I get their permission first? That sounds like something I would ask. Oh my gosh, that totally sounds like something I would ask. That's the kind of stuff that made me write Mirror Mural, you guys. Which I presume you have not allowed me to forget, right? Ooh, you know what I saw the other day that I really wanted to build in Minecraft? It was a secret, it was a secret bed. I would love to make that secret bed, but I'd have to, I'd have to look up the thing of how to do it. But I think it'd be fun. What if we made a treehouse and inside of the treehouse there was a secret bed? Is that what we should spend our time doing tonight? I will. I'll do it. Don't tempt me. I'll do it in a heartbeat. I'll do it in an absolute heartbeat. You can try and no, 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 no! <laughs> oh my mind guard! No! I was just a second too late, dude. Oh, I tried so hard to. Oh, maybe I can catch up to it. I still love my underwater tunnel. Still proud of it. I worked hard on this tunnel. I slaved away for hours on end. But I feel like ever since they uh, commandeered my um, my Wayne Manor. No! Again? Again? This ain't chatting. This is Minecraft. I, I should have updated the category. Did it not take? I should have updated it. Why is there water dripping to my roof? Why is there water dripping through my roof? Oh, we do not appreciate this. Okay, it is it is updated now. That's good. All right, we're gonna have to fix my roof. I gotta find my blocks. I know I need a roofer. A roofer. Um. Um. I don't remember where my stone is. None of those are the right stone. No! I don't remember how to make this. <laughs> Zando, your got chop on! Disable! Disable the G diffusers! Man, this is my third bean of the night! Zando, right or left? Ah! Mm hmm. I believe this is birthday cake or dirty dishwasher, but it could also be Tutti Frutti or Stinky Socks. But you got it. Bottoms up. Oh, yes! Yes! Wait. Yes, yes. For a sec. Yes. Yes, but I don't think I like Tutti Frutti. Every now and again, I get a hint of Stinky Sock in there. And I'm getting worried that I like the taste of Stinky Socks. I'm worried that you guys have, have spoiled me. My brain is ruined. <laughs> Zando, I don't know if you're gonna get this one, my friend. I don't know if you're gonna get this one, but I will try. Okay. <clears throat> Zando redeemed movie, movie game. That is where we have combined two movie titles together and I read off the combined movie description 
and then Zando will get a chance to guess first the combined title that I'm reading off of. Um, if you get the answer, please do not type it in the chat until Zando gets a chance to guess. Here we go. A teenager with thyroid cancer falls for a cancer-stricken teenage boy with sweet tree surfing skills who was raised in the deep jungle by gorillas with an affinity for Phil Collins. A teenager with thyroid cancer falls for a cancer-stricken teenage boy with sweet tree surfing skills who was raised in the deep jungle by gorillas with an affinity for Phil Collins. That is so good and you certainly got it. The Fall in Our Stars Ann. <laughs> it sounds great. The Fall in Our Stars Ann is indeed the title of this movie. Oh, that's so good. That's so good, dude. You'll be my heart No matter where you are When I'm building down When I'm building down Oh no And you'll be my heart Oh, nope Nope, wrong one Man, how did I do this? This? Ah, how did I do it? How do you do it? Where's Christina? Where is Splash? Where is Pineapple? Someone remind me how to make these stones. You've never seen Tarzan? I always associate it with the winning the best original song Oscar over South Park's Blame Canada. While I agree that is a travesty, I can't believe you've never seen Tarzan. You've never seen Tarzan? Um, this pattern. How do I make this pattern on my walls? I thought it was with the stone cutter, but clearly I'm wrong. Oh, I remember. I remember. I have to heat the stone. I have to get smooth stone, right? There it is. What is going on? Rain has never seen Tarzan. Zando has never seen Tarzan. What is happening? All right, I'm going to need, I am going to need everybody. Nope, I was wrong. How do I do it? How do I do it, Pineapple? I thought that I got smooth stone and I went to the stone gutter and then I thought it would give me the options of all the different stone types to make and I can't figure it out. This is not what I want. Do I have to do it again? Maybe it's not smooth stone. Maybe it's just stone. Just stone. And how do I make that? All right, let's get andesite. Maybe I just heat it once. Maybe if I heat it the second time, I get smooth stone. Stone is heated cobblestone. Are you sure it's not every kind of stone heats up into stone? I trust you, I don't know. I'm asking. Why do I keep doing that? Just, just, just go in my inventory. 100% just cobblestone. Oopsie. Quick move, all of it. I don't have a lot of cobblestone, so that's gonna be an issue. I was 14 when it came out. For some reason, I thought it was released in 97. We were just having a conversation about how young I am. So maybe this is just a moment where I'm, I'm, I'm so young. I'm just so young. Or, well, I don't have a lot of cobblestone. I have exactly one piece. Is that going to be enough? Cool story, bro, but you need to go watch Tarzan or at least listen to the rad soundtrack. I agree. What's up, Harry? How we doing? We're playing Minecraft, but I could very easily be swayed otherwise. I'll swear. I really was just playing because nobody was here yet. Alright, I need precisely one piece. Yes! Victory! Boom! Ha 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 ha! 
I am the roofer. I am the one who roofs. Bed too far away. Well, I was trying to go to sleep for you, Pineapple. Pinocchio, Cinderella, Snow White, Fantasia, 101 Dalmatians, the list goes on. Wait. 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 Those are all the movies you've not seen? Is that what you're saying right now? What are you saying right now? Is that what you're saying? You've not seen those movies? You've not seen the movie Cinderella? You've not seen Fantasia? What? I feel, I feel betrayed. I'm just dumbfounded. I'm dumbfounded right now. I think I've seen most Disney animated features except Sleeping Beauty, which I just generally have no interest in. That's, that's a really good point. Why does Sleeping Beauty seem so disinteresting, you know? What's my dude doing? My dude, there's a skeleton right there, my bro. My bro, there's a skeleton right there. I was child number three in the late 80s and early 90s. My parents didn't really try there. Well, same, but I did see a lot of movies. I saw a lot of movies because my parents didn't try, you know? Brother man, brother man, there was a, there was a, there was a skeleton right there. And you just didn't care. All right, let's see if I can find that missing stone. Oh, I found it. I found it. My dad is a tad Disney obsessed. He's a Disney adult faux show. No shade. No shade on the Disney adults. A little shade, but not that much shade. My parents were also in their late 40s when I came around and weren't about to try to figure out movie rentals when I was already interested in video games. But you also have, you also have two children. Have they never seen these movies? Or do you just not watch them whenever they watch them? Where's this hole? Where is it? There it is, there it is. Yes! <laughs> the greatest gamer, Turtle! How can I trap him and keep him forever? Does anyone know? I want that turtle to never leave my property. What, what can I do to make that happen? I'm gonna need that turtle to be my friend forever. Helen is just now starting to sit through portions of movies at a time. Oh man, maybe we just have a lazy daughter because Nora loves watching movies. She will 100% just sit in front of the TV and watch a movie. She loves it. Just like her, just like her father. And her father's father before him. My family was too poor for Disney. It used to be a premium channel. Oof. That is taking it back. I remember we didn't have, um... It wasn't four kids, but it was whatever showed One Piece. I could only watch it whenever I was at the beach. For some reason, we only picked it up on the antenna at the beach. So it wasn't even that it was premium. It was that it was so not premium that we could only get it on the antenna. We couldn't get it on our bougie uh, direct TV. Helen will watch TV shows for hours, but if the show is as long as her attention span, she's not interested. What I watched the other night with, um, is that a block of gold? What, what? What you doing, Pineapple? Um, we actually just watched Beauty and the Beast the other day for the first time, and it was really sweet. All right. I want to build a tree fort. It's a gift. Ah, it's a bunch of stone. Do I keep the box too? Or are you just giving me the stone? It's a shulker box. I rewatched many of those Disney movies working at a camp and as a student when we had substitutes and no work left and such. Uh, I definitely don't watch much Disney nowadays. I made it through about half of a story, Toy Story 3 yesterday and then started playing with toys and stopped paying attention. I mean, I can relate there. I also don't really care to make it through Toy Story. 
Is that a hot take? Is that a hot take? Is that a hashtag hot take? Toy Story's kind of overrated. Hashtag hot take. I'm tired of Toy Story. I don't really like them that much. They're really just fine movies. Kind of over it. Kind of over it. I'm kind of over you. I'm kind of over you. That's pretty much the only lyrics I can sing from that song. That's about it. Yep, yep, yep. She sat through the Paw Patrol movie and the new My Little Pony movie, but the first real movie that she sat through was Frozen, Frozen 2. Ooh, Frozen. Love the first one I could do without the rest. See, I've even gotten... I don't, I don't like, dislike the first one. But I'm no longer in need to watch the first one. I could go the rest of my life without ever seeing the first Toy Story again. All right, I'm gonna go build a treehouse. Do I have any wood? I do not. I do have some ladders. I'm gonna go ahead and take those. Go ahead and take a take some take a take a stick. And go ahead and take a trapdoor. Um, take a fence, sure. Take a log. Why not? Why not? I don't think I'm gonna need any stones for this. Oh boy, I need to find that tutorial again though. Ooh, I'm definitely gonna need some axes. Just go ahead and throw an axe in here. Another axe in here. What's up, Hylian Hufflepuff? How we doing? Welcome to the stream. Hope you're doing all right. Hope that life is treating you well right now. Welcome in, welcome in. Happy that you're here. How's your week going? It's Wednesday. It's Wednesday, my dudes. How could it be that? How? How could it be Wednesday, though? This doesn't feel right. We got a new podcast dropping. In two days. How can that be true? Home day! Just streaming on my ministry page. Rock on, Highly Enough Above. Yes, if you're not on our Discord. Ah! Ah, no! Not again! If you're not on our Discord, which you should be, um, you will find that we have tons of awesome, awesome uh, Christian and ministerial streamers, such as Highly Enough Above, out there. And we'd love for you to check them out whenever they post in our streaming channel. My parents very rarely bought VHS tapes for me. I didn't really get started, start getting movies uh, until I got a DVD player, but the Toy Story was one of that made my mom, made my mom take me to the store to get when it came out. I was obsessed with it as a kid. Yeah, I, um, I rented a lot. I rented a lot of movies from the movie gallery. We didn't even have Blockbuster. We had movie gallery. Play on, play on, play on. Lurk, need to stretch my legs as I've been sitting too long. All good, Zando. Or all good, Trombo, excuse me. I think I post my Twitch link in the server. I just wish I had, like, two people watching. I feel that, man. I'm so sorry. I feel it. It's tough. It's really tough. Um, those are long days. Those are long and arduous days, and I totally feel you. Don't get much traffic. You know. It takes it takes time, and sometimes our streams get some attention, and sometimes they don't. You just gotta kind of uh, you just kind of kind of cope. But I feel you. That's something that um, I don't know if Jate is still here lurking and pooping, but that's something that I think folks like Jate and XGN Ninja and folks like that have a real heart for caring for the streamers, and that's something that I would love to see us do at Checkpoint. We just don't currently do it. But I'd love to see that happen because I think that's incredibly important. We need to care for the care for the streamers. It's hard. It's hard mental work. That's one of my big pieces of advice. Also, so we we have we have a plan somewhere down the road to eventually start streaming on our or like to have people stream on our channel. And um, while I love that and I love the possibility of doing that and I want that to happen and I look forward to when we're able to make it happen, um, I'm also very much like don't commit to more than like a stream like as soon as you're like I'm going to stream every week I'm going to slow you down because it's really hard work it's really emotional work it is emotional work to uh, put on a stream and it's emotional work to have nobody show right so I totally feel that. I'll take this crafting bench. 
Gotta find the right spot for my treehouse. It's none of these places. I don't, I don't, I don't like this, the savannah feel. Actually, you know, to drop by my stream for a tiny bit. I've been streaming on the page for a year and a half, I believe, maybe a bit over half, but I don't know. I feel that. For me, I'm, I'm, I'm just not interested or willing to play one game. I find that a lot of people that have the pretty massive audiences on Twitch, they play like a game and I'm just not interested in it. But it is also nice having the mindset at checkpoint of like, we're never going to be the biggest streamer. That's not our goal. We don't really have a goal for our Twitch audience to get huge or anything. We want to reach people with our Discord more than anything. Whoopsie. Is that the Eye of Sauron? Is anybody watching Rings of Power this weekend? What's up? What's up, folks? Are we watching Rings of Power or what? Are we hearing good things, bad things, in between things? How are we feeling? Are we ready? Are we amped? Are we excited? Does not have Prime. Oh, no. I don't like any of these spots for my treehouse. Where am I going to put my treehouse? If it takes this long just to find a treehouse spot, what am I going to do? But I hear you, Hylian. I will be I will be praying for a turnaround for you. For things to lighten their load a little bit. Just make your treehouse better than mine. I don't know about better than anybody's. I just want it to be mine. I just need another house. I don't have enough houses yet. You see? Yes, she? I really just want to do the bed thing. I need to I need to try to find that TikTok. I could make it in this little tree forest that we built over here, but then that feels like invading a space that already exists, you know? I just don't like any of these forests! I need a better forest! I need the forest that feels right for me. None of these feel right. By the way, for real, Zando or Perry, if you have a game that you want to play, let me know. I will hop off Minecraft. This is our game together night. And we do have Pineapple Pup, I think, hopping in the server right now, but... I'm sure Pineapple would also be down to clown with some other games. I legit have no idea what to suggest. I feel that. If you're not feeling anything, then you're not feeling anything. Wow, look at that massive tree. Is that a tree? Wow. What is this? That's incredible. Oh, not that, just that I don't own any multiplayer. I'm always down for Phasmophobia. I have it downloaded. I don't know how to play it. I've literally never queued it up. Oh, yeah, I forgot about this, too. <laughs> Man, I've built so many houses, I don't even remember what houses I'm, I've, I'm like, last worked on. That's hysterical. <laughs> I forgot about this one. Oh, man, that's embarrassing. <laughs> that is so embarrassing to have so many houses you forget which ones you're working on. <laughs> I didn't like the way this one looked. It was so, it was so, um, this frustrated me to no end. Remember, I tried to build the, like, closing door, and then it just didn't work, and then I was like, well, if it's not going to work, then I'm not even going to bother. And then I pitched my little hissy fit, and I stopped. <laughs> That's great, dude. <laughs> I mean, I worked so hard. I so worked so hard on this house. I, I made chests. Oh, hilarious. Yeah, this was where uh, this is where we talked about um, enneagrams when I was building this. 
I wanted to be able to surver survey the land. Is that Taco Dude's house? With the glass over there? Oh, there's so many things in here. Look at all those powered rails that I got. Wow. Oh yeah, and the glowstones, dude. There was so much I was working on. And then I just got distracted and never looked at it again. That's very funny. That really is just the funniest. <laughs> Look at Wayne Manor, dude. Christina is wild. Speaking of, I hope Christina is enjoying college. Does anybody else have Phasmophobia that would want to play it? Alternative question, um, Pineapple, is that a two-person game? Can we play with two people? Or does it need more than two people to play? I literally know nothing about it. Ooh, there's creepers out here. Four people. Does anybody else have Phasmophobia that wants to play? That sounds like a no-go. Is there like a waiting room where people are waiting to play? Ooh. Oh, I'm already losing steam on my treehouse. The chatting over there? Having a little combo? There is a waiting lobby. Wow. He just butt me? He did! He did! No! Get off that spider! Get off that spider! What is the game? You're saying it so fast and I'm halfway paying attention. Phasmophobia. It's a spooky, spooky ghost game. Spooky, scary, spooky, scary ghost game. Ooh, I see some different colored trees over there. <gasps> Is this a forest? <gasps> a mushroom forest! Ooh! Oh, this place is just begging for a tree house! Oh my goodness, this place was born! It was born for a tree house, dude! Ha ha ha! Yes! Oh! Oh my goodness, this place is just- it's begging for it, dude! It's begging for a tree house to be built here. Oh, wow. Okay, let me pull up Tiki Taki. See if I can remember how to make that bed thing, because that's really my main goal for the night now. I think it's redstone, though. And that would be- that would be an issue. Time to go through 147 TikToks. That I've no doubt looked through in the past couple days. This is the kind of content you're here for, folks. Is this the reason you're here? To watch me scroll through TikTok? Oh, I saw this the other day, too. Micro house. Very fun. All right, now I'm already distracted by others. <laughs> Ain't never heard of it. Xando, it's real fun, apparently. Apparently, it popped off a while ago. It was definitely a very popular one. Yes, I found it. Secret base. Oh, well, that doesn't really work for a treehouse, does it? Oh man, this is such an easy build. I could build this. I could build this easy build. I could build this very easy build. Easy peasy. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy, I could build this build. Easiest of peasies. Wow! Oh, I could do this. Oh, gorgeous. Oh, wow! A secret base! Ah, oh, delightful. All right, there's the materials required. Well, this is totally what I should do. All right, so I guess first things first, I should probably go get the materials that I am needing. Um, or, or I just go ahead and start working on my treehouse, and the and the materials will 
Nay, watching TikToks is the content we stay for. Is Fancy Phobia on Game Pass? I doubt it. I'd be very surprised. Do you have Game Pass now? Side tangent. When did you get Game Pass? Are you a Game Passer now? Because we had this conversation not too long ago. And you were not a Game Passer. You got the $1 a month trial. It's very worth it. Yeah, I'm not about the tree base anymore. <laughs> I don't really care about the tree base anymore. Now I'm just kind of focused on the secret secret base. Ah! Don't kill me. I would love to be a consistent game passer, but I definitely can't afford it. Yeah, if you don't use it, it's definitely too expensive. If you use it, it's very much worth it. If you do not use it, not with the Pokemon card obsession. That's another game I thought about playing tonight. I thought about pulling up the, the trading card game, playing a couple rounds of that. PC is no problem. Yeah, it's not Xbox Game Pass, you guys. You guys are, first off, first off, shame on you for even calling it that. It's not Xbox Game Pass. It's called PC Game Pass. Get it right. Get it right, you guys. Okay. So what I need, I need two beds, two wool cubes, two wood cubes, four dirt cubes, two railways, two mine carts, four ladders, two steps, and 13 flat panels. Easy. But which base needs it? I could always put it down in the basement of this base, but there is a bed up here. Hmm. Let's see. What could I do? Do I have any other homes? Oh, my secret home. No. No. I'll do it here. I'll build it in the basement here. So I'm gonna build this in the basement of this spot, and then I'm gonna work on that for you, Xando. Okay, so let me go ahead and dump off everything that I don't need. Which I guess I should put this shulk box down, yeah. Nope. Okay, then we'll put everything else away. Don't need that. I only need, how many did that say I needed? Four? Four of these? I can do math. You guys, I don't mean to brag, but I am a, I am a mather. I'm very gifted when it comes to math, okay? Don't let anybody tell you different. I'm very, very good at it. Okay. For those, I need two railways. I got more than two. Two railways, uh, two mine carts. How do I make such a thing? It did say that I needed 13 of these. That's nearly 13. Just iron. Um, two beds. I don't know if I have any wool. I got plenty of iron. Why do I keep hitting the wrong button? The world may never know. I'm gonna have to find some sheeps. Okay, perfect. I needed two mine carts, and that's exactly what I got. Two mine carts, 13 slabs, two blocks, four dirt cubes. Okay, I need 
two of these. Four dirt cubes. There's got to be a fast way to do that, huh? Um, two wood blocks. Oh, I already got those. Two steps. Boop, 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 boop. Guess I gotta go make some steps. How many steps do I need? Two? Two. Point. No, it took up too much. I didn't need that many. Now I need one more wood block. Look what you've done. I can't believe you've done this. Now I'm gonna be mixing stones. Oh, this is the worst. Mixing patterns everywhere. Oh, this simply will not do. It just did what I thought it did, didn't it? Certainly did. All this just because I wanted steps, dude. And then there were more wood planks in there, weren't there? Delightful. All right, two minecarts, done. Oh, I still need two wool cubes and two beds. Now that is gonna be tricky. Thanks for the follow, creepy black snake. Appreciate you. How'd you find us? How'd you stumble upon this channel? We're happy that you're here. Welcome. Welcome, welcome. We're glad you're here. What just happened? 13 of those. What? Oh, I dropped them. Oh, I dropped them. Ha! Two, two wool cubes and two beds. Am I sure I don't have any beds or wool in here? Who could I steal from? Who of my friends could I go take two beds and two wool cubes from? Who among my friends would not mind some, some gentle thievery? Whoa! Why has that been hollowed out? That's kind of gnarly looking. Whoa! Gladly spare some. I need I need two wool cubes and two beds. That's Wayne Manor. And you can bring them to me in Wayne Manor if you want to do that. And that way I can go show everybody a little tour. We can go see what Christina's done. Before playing some Pokemons. I might need to update my launcher. It's been a long time. Been a long time since the rock and roll. Been a long time, been a long time, been a long, 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 long time. Oh, come on. Oh, come on. I didn't need that. I just want to make it to the top of Wayne Manor. That's all I want. All I want is to be at the top. I guess I can go through the, I guess I can go through this way. If it still exists. Look at all those furnaces. I'm just killing time on Overwatch. Let me know if and when you want to play some Pokemans. Yeah, as long as it doesn't require like a lengthy update, we'll find out. Whoa, oh my goodness. That is so gigantic. Christina. You've lost it. <laughs> she found a beacon too, dude. Bonkers. That explains why I have the like, golden pickaxe thing. Look at this. Look at this behemoth. I wanna know what all this is though. Is this just, is she just digging all of this out? For resources? It's so massive. <laughs> it's just silly. 
Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. And two old blocks. Beautiful. You're the best, pineapple. Appreciate ya. Nice. I love the color choice for the wool, too. Alright, will I die? I will die. I will die if I do that. Okay. Boink. 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 You have the stuff. Thank you, thank you. All right, now I'm gonna make my secret base. My secret base under my secret base. Under my like 14th house. We'll put a definitely not ominous bed right here. <laughs> definitely not anything suspicious about a bed right here. Nothing weird about that. <laughs> not a thing. All right, let's see. They go too deep here. So. Ooh, that's very deep. That's four deep. That's four deep. Ooh, that's, that's, ooh, going so fast. Okay. All right. Here we go. Moment of truth. We're gonna go four deep, boink, 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 boink. I don't know if I need to be this close to the wall. Do I need to be in the middle of the wall? I got no clue. That looks like four deep to me. The four deep, one, two, three. No, not quite four deep. Boink, boink. Do I want Neothite? I do not know what that is. If I told you I didn't know what it was, would you believe me? Would you hold it against me? Come on. Oh, come on. So it must not be. I'm worried it's not actually this deep. I'm worried it's only three deep. I'm a little worried it's only three deep. I'm a little worried about that. The tier above diamond? Sure. Didn't even know that was a thing. Are you serious? Ah, are you serious? I hope it is actually 3D, and I'm just not making a fool of myself here. Okay. Okay. Now! Now! Now we're cooking! Now let's watch me work some magic with these slabs that are easy to control. Slabs, it's so easy to put them exactly where you want them to be, you know? That's what I always say. That definitely does not look like where it should be. I don't think it should be there. I think it should be on the bottom. Yeah. Yeah, that looks right. I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. I do not know what I'm doing. Right, first dirt point. Nope, too much dirt. I don't want to go down there. I don't want to go down there. All right, then they put a mine cart on top of that. How do I? How do I? <laughs> what? What? How do I do that? How do I put a minecart on the dirt? Pineapple. Oh no, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. How do I put how do I put a minecart on dirt? Oh, you'll need my gear. Boink. Thank you so much about the 
The opposite of putting a dirt cart on mine. All right, there's the gear over there. Sorry. So, can I not do this? Well, how did they do it? Oh man, and there's a, and there's a, and there's a this down here. You guys. I feel like this is above my skill level already. Okay, dig, 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 dig. That is definitely four deep, dude. That's three times, it's three high. I knew it, I knew it, I knew it, I knew it. I knew it was three high. I knew it, I knew it, I knew it, I knew it, I knew it. You can't fool me. I pick up my gear. Rats. Uh, there's gotta be an easier way to drop. Wait. Tools too. I like my tools. <sighs> he did put down a rail. He did put down a rail. I see now. He did put down a rail. Okay. Okay. All right. What? Okay, so then he puts down dirt, then he puts down a rail. Then he puts down the minecart. Then he destroys the dirt. Yes, yeah, so then the minecart falls. Ha, I see, genius. Okay, then he puts, whoa, whoa, moved way too fast there, bucko. Then he puts, then he puts, then he puts dirt right, mm, right, mm, right, mm, right there. Yeah, maybe. Puts a rail right there, and then he puts the other minecart. Here. Yeah. Okay. Then he does this. Beautiful. Then he does that right there. Ooh. And right there. Oh no. Oh no. What did I do wrong? What did I do? What did I do wrong? What did I do wrong? I did it all. I did it all exactly the way I was shown. No, no, where did the minecart go? Oh, this is the worst. Does it have to be in that order? Will I now ruin everything by doing it this way? No. It's supposed to go there! supposed to work why did it not work 
Guys, I don't like games. I don't- I'm not a fan of games. <laughs> Why did it not work? Why did it not work? For what reason? Is it Bedrock or Java? I have no idea. These are questions I don't know. I'm so tired of that question. I am so tired of that question. Is it Bedrock or Java? Honestly, at this point, I'm wanting to... I think that whoever... Whoever is currently overseeing the development and release of Minecraft needs to executively say, we're tired of that question and we're remaking it. We're redoing it all. We're remaking Minecraft so that people no longer have to ask such a question. These are not doors. These are not doors. Slabs was incorrect. Slabs was incorrect. That was the mistake. They did not want slab, they wanted trapdoors. Oh, they wanted trapdoors. Not slabs. Definitely looked like slabs. Definitely looked like slabs in the picture. They want trapdoors. That makes so much more sense. Do I have trapdoors? I'm sure I do. How many trapdoors do they want? They want 13 trapdoors? All right. That makes so much more sense now. That's so many trapdoors. Do I have to start over now? Okay, well, the good news is we have tons of wood here. Um, we also have so many slabs. Truly too many slabs. All right, well now we got a bunch of trap doors. Let's go see if that solved our issue. I got it. I made them. That's literally the opposite of what I wanted. It's quite literally the opposite of what I was hoping, in fact. Okay, I guess we're just starting over, huh? Okay, all righty then. Now we're starting over from the very beginning. Oh, that's why you wanted so many trapdoors. Decoration. It's gonna look silly. My trapdoors don't look as good as his. You have more trapdoors than you thought? Just a bunch of trapdoors for whatever reason? Wait. I did the wrong one. No, I didn't just do that. Is that gonna mess everything up? No, I didn't.
You can't be serious. I didn't just do all of this. For no reason. The trapdoors were supposed to work! That was supposed to be the man- Okay, it did work, it did work, it did work. So what's that one's deal then? Oh, I see those are on top of the ground. Is this one on top of the ground? No, it's flesh. Yeah, it's an error. It's an error, it's gotta be a Java thing, dude. Uh, I'll try the bottom. I think it just can't be placed there. All right, I'm done with Minecraft. <laughs> I'm done. I'm done. Minecraft, you're really only sort of fun. You do get very addicting whenever I know what I want to do, but then whenever things don't work literally once, I'm done. I have a very short fuse when it comes to Minecraft. All right, Pokemans. I probably got to update the app. In fact, I almost guarantee I got to update the app. I also have so many cards to redeem in here, we could honestly do that the rest of stream. And probably still not be done. To be quite frank. Oh man. I'm wearing down folks. Anybody else been up since 4.30? Where are my 4.30 folks at? Where are my 4.30 a.m. folks at? Minecraft, you're really only sort of fun. Good quote. Uh-oh, where'd it go? There it is. Uh-oh. Not my login info. Thank goodness it didn't pick up full screen. I've been up since 9 p.m. last night. That doesn't count. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Why? I fell asleep on the couch and woke up at 2.30. That definitely counts. Why are y'all not sleeping? Get some sleep, you hooligans. You bunch of hooligans? Yeah, I haven't looked at my avatar in a while. Let's go remember how to play the game. Uh, I don't remember how to play. That's why I'm trying to- I'm trying to go to a basic level patch here. I gotta teach myself how to play Pokemons again. Let's go to my- my good deck here. Let's play Zack. Zack with my best deck! Zando, add me. Add me on Pokemons if you haven't yet. I'm sure I'm just the Nate Dub. <laughs> What's up with the Total Drama avatars? Dude, I'm so ready! You have to understand. I'm so ready. For them to please. Oh, two fire energy. Oopsie. Oh well. Worth it. Worth it. Um Yeah, I'm I'm so incredibly ready for them to release the stinking new update, dude. I don't know when they're gonna do it, but I need it. Had some things I had to do, then work got done on my electricity on my house, then class, then this. Oh my goodness. Yes, please get some sleep. Get some sleep. Oops, I gotta be up at 8 tomorrow. Ugh! Oh, man. Well, then we're just the sleepy gang over here. Zach's doing pretty good. Zach's doing pretty good here. Yeah. 
Northeastern. Finishing this round and then I'll hop on. Rock on. Soundtrack's playing right now? Not too shabby. I've really got to remember how to play. Oh, I didn't change the game either. I'm just so ready for the new app. Updated avatars. I'm ready for everything to look better. It's gonna happen. The question is when. Why does he have any fire attached to him? Did I miss something? I would be happy with beards that aren't black, right? Do 60 damage. It's not a lot. Uh, let's not do his attack yet, though. Let me it! Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's live it up. <laughs> he used some items I couldn't see what they did. He's definitely doing better than I expected. Apparently, Zack is doing okay. Thought I went to the easy matches, but clearly I didn't. Do me too. Oh no. I need a card that it's not giving me. Why is it not giving me that card? Hello there. What's up, Zando? Demon Zando. How's it going? <laughs> How are we feeling? Uh, similar to you, sleepy. Very sleepy. Not 4.30, but Ben woke me up at 6.30 this morning, which is about an hour and a half earlier than I'm used to. Just use Pot of Greed, says Pineapple Pope. I would if I could, my friend. That sounds like a good plan. Zando, I had to remind myself how to play the game, and now I remember. Well, that's bad news for me. But it's not, I'm not good at it necessarily. 
So make well, no mistakes there. That's good for me, I guess. Or at least I'm not doing very good this round. But I may still pull it out in the end. We'll see. Can everybody hear Zando okay? Can y'all hear me okay? Just sent you a... So much damage. But I do have my welder now, so... I've got two new booster packs to open. Oh, do you? Mm-hmm. That's very fun. Let's go ahead and do Digital this. ones, not any fancy real ones. Ooh, I got a cool looking Eevee. And, I've, got, uh, I've got so Zarude many digital a. cards, it's ridiculous. Zarude V. Okay, Psy Shock. Bam. 100 damage. Not enough. The other one sounds good, says Chris. The other one does sound good. Trombone will never live that down. I mean, it's still in my Discord name. Okay. I'm kind of helping it along. Hmm. What shall I do? Sometimes you just have so many options. This deck. I'd forgotten how much I love this deck. So have you have you purchased any um like extra decks at this point? Uh in the in the digital game? Sure. Uh no. I made a deck just now. I don't know if it's any good, but I did the little wizard thing. Oh yeah. I've tried that several um, times and they are never good. I'll be very okay. interested to well, see if you're if you if you've developed a good one. I also don't know like outside of the cards that I physically have, I don't I can't keep track of all the random stuff that I've gotten from just random cards. Right. So we'll see. I do have the uh Mel Metal V battle deck that I bought in store that then also transferred to the game. So we can try that one. Yeah, that was my, my Mewtwo deck was one that I bought in store. Sleepy, how is your day treating you today, though? And everybody in the chat. Good. I feel like I had a, a really productive day at work. Um, probably because I didn't watch any streams. I usually kind of feel like <laughs> They do take um, up so much time, don't they? Yeah. I had a lot of meetings around the time you guys were streaming this morning, so I didn't get to jump in then. And then I just didn't bother seeing who else was streaming. Yeah, it was a, it's a good productive day. Helen was up at like 6.30, which is why I got up that early. Um... And, you know, luckily I can still, like, just tell them, hey, chill out, it's time to go to bed. But Ben, Ben's been dealing with some serious diaper rash lately, so when he woke up screaming this morning, I was like, uh, let's go check that out. 
Um, but Helen also didn't nap today, so when I got home, she was in a real, a real mood. <laughs> oh yeah, I know that feel. All right, let's see how bad my quote-unquote new deck is. So this is one you just built. This is the one I just used, used the wizard for. I was really surprised my update didn't take longer. It's no good. It has you pick two cards that you like, and then uh, and then go from there. So I picked out uh, Phalanx. That was my choice. That is funny. So that's the new Pokemon Go, and I've not even used that in game. I haven't used most of the cards that I've gotten in game yet. To be fair. <laughs> Weird. It wouldn't let me use Growl, even though it has to be attached to it. Hmm. It's weird. That's a great pit up. So did I not get fire weakness because neither of your moves have fire energy attached to them? Correct. Okay. These are the things that I still need to learn and understand. I don't really want to waste this. Ah! Should I not be looking at the stream since I can see your hand, or is Probably that cheating? Not. <laughs> okay. Oh, you did get a weakness there. Interesting. I don't know why. I don't know if you didn't get a weakness. There. No, you had you had twenty damage, so you did get weakness. Oh, the was first it a time. ten the first time? Okay, yeah. I guess I just wasn't paying that close of attention. It's just a really weak move. Yeah, the big crisis with this deck is that I can run out of cards really fast. I almost go through too many cards. Just literally delaying the inevitable there. Oh man. Right, it'll be worth it. Unless weakness still ties in, in which case... Oh, wait, no, it says it doesn't. Okay. Wow. No damage. this much if I don't get some better cards we are gonna have quite the crisis
switcheroonie. I have this thing. Is this good? That is good. Or she too. Yeah, rapid strike. I have no idea. V cards. I know nothing about them. I don't either. When your, your Pokemon V is knocked out. Ooh, I take two prize cards? That's fun. Yeah. Well, I guess that makes it worth it since you got a 150 hitter move. Interesting. It's real tricky having the colorless energy look a lot like the steel energy at first. Right. Don't appreciate that so much. Oh, man. All right. I'm going to go for a totally new pull, even if this isn't a smart. Just got to have some better cards. Okay, that'll do. That'll do. What is this? Once during each player's turn, that player discards the top three cards. If a player discarded any items cards, they put those item cards in their hand. Ooh, I don't like that at all. They just straight up discard cards? No, 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 no. I don't like it. I definitely thought you were just being nice to me whenever you didn't um, use your 150 hitter move, and then I oh, realized yeah, no, that you I don't, don't have, have the... two fighting. Yep. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So I just need one more fighting, and then maybe I can do something. But until then, have fun with my strafe. No. So in a normal in a normal <laughs> game, do you just agree ahead of time how many uh, prize cards you have? Or no, it it's always six. six. Okay. Six is. And like do those the... just come off like the top of the deck when you start? Um. Yeah, I think they are the first thing that you normally sort out. Okay. You probably shuffle after. I don't know. I'd have to read the official rule book to see what they actually want you to do. I feel like I should probably read the official rule book. All right. Okay. Yeah, this will be fine. We'll be fine. But none of my, I, was, I was surprised the ETB didn't come with one, like a rule book. Oh, the ETB didn't? It should have. I didn't see one. Yeah, that, it should be in your little guidebook. There should be rules in there, is there not? In the little in the little card, uh, the thing where you check off the boxes, not at the beginning. Yeah, it just it no, it kind of just tells you about the new stuff. Interesting. This says, welcome to your elite trainer box, and these are the new things that you'll have in here. I could have sworn there was a rule book in there. Maybe there's a rule book. Whenever I think you... maybe it tells you about the new stuff for Pokemon Go, the Pokemon Go expansion, maybe? Right. Where did I get one? I know I have some. I have like several. I should remember to send it to you. I'll just bring it to LTNCon. That's it. Yeah, at this point, I just need to bring. I need to know everybody that's going to LTNCon, and I'll just bring all their stuff. Yikes. Yeah, but if you got fighting energy, you can take me down in one hit. And that's no fun. I don't have any fighting energy. No! Yeah. 
Man, I can't get anything. I can't win for losing. I might have to do the discard. I don't want to do that, though. Uh, I don't want to discard three cards. Oh. I'm not getting much else. Man. What the heck? Yeah, the pokey stop thing is kind of dumb, huh? No! Uh, what a waste. <laughs> Man, didn't even get anything for it. Oh, lame. Lame, dude. You got, got two, two cards, items. So. I got bust and you got two. That's a bummer. Let's see if that does anything for me. If the Pokemon this card is statue doesn't have a rule box. It does 30 less damage from attacks. Takes 30 less damage. Ooh. Oh, so I had to, that was so dumb. And you got tails. No. Oh, that's a bummer. Discard this card and it flip a coin. If it if it's heads, then you get to get another card. Cool. That doesn't really help too much. I need energy so I can do anything. Finally. How? Finally, finally, finally. Okay. I don't know, maybe not. Okay. Well, that item did not do anything for you. I guess you did have a rule box. Oh, yes. Weird. The crisis for me with building decks has always been energy. I always have trouble getting energy. The energy proportion correct. So I typically do single type if I'm going to do anything. We got an energy, but I can't use it on any of these cards. Cool. <laughs> Yeah, Pokestop, Pokestop can go ahead and go right in the trash pile. Yep. I mean, I guess if the, if the situation were opposite and I had a ton of Pokemon and a ton of energy and I just needed some items, like, maybe. about how it was fighting and how it was going to be weak immediately. Oh, very nice. That's what the yeah. secret was that all of my, my prize cards were actually like good prizes because they were all hiding. They were all the cards I've been looking for the whole time. Cool. I keep seeing all these energy cards getting discarded. <laughs> right? <laughs> like, oh, I need his energy. I guess I'll try anyway. And instead, the next time I draw a card on my turn, it'll be like, <laughs> pick a Pokemon. <laughs> oh, man. All right, good. I got enough energy in there. I'm going to go ahead and do this guy. Oh, that beautiful energy. Now I'm not even going to feel bad if I can start using my, uh, <laughs> my Shifu, right? <laughs> or whatever his name is. 
Urshifu. Alright. Just in case I need it. Alright, here's the gamble. All it's gonna take is for you to get that fighting. If the Pokemon V card that's attached to has Vaporeon, Jolteon, or Flareon in its name, it, it costs one thing less. Sure doesn't. <laughs> Do you have any of those three in your deck? Nah, bro. I don't think so. It's just a straight up filler card, just a burner card. Oh man, I guess I would have won it right there if I had, huh? He sure would have. I just love this deck. On, fight. Nope. Cool. But at least I killed your Mewtwo. You did. And I got a card that'll that'll help maybe next time. But this is where. Uh, yeah, I don't oh, know yeah, if you're you gonna. Kill. I don't know if you're gonna make yeah, it. Yeah, no, you. You could always just do the the find wildfire. Just I could make things interesting. I could do that. <laughs> I could, but I'm I'm. I got to put you out of your misery of this deck. That's fair. That's the issue with the with the auto builders. It's such a pain. Mm -hmm. They never do energy right. All right, I'm down to try another deck. If you are, sure. I'm gonna try. I have so many at this point, but I've just never tried. Oh, this one's kind of fun. What what typing are you going to do? I'm going to try not to be at an advantage. Uh, I have either a, a Psychic deck, it looks like, Mental Might, or my Melmetal deck, which is Steel and Colorless. Uh, is Fighting Strong against Steel or Weak against I don't, Steel? I don't think so. Let me double check. Or I'll just do grass. Grass is not. Okay. I'll do my Decidui deck. That's a real fun one. It's like I have a fire deck. <laughs> go for it. Whenever you go through the like little challenges, you have to beat all the different typings. Mm -hmm. And I remember I had a tough time with some of the fires. That's a nice little Rowlet coin. It is. I have that in real life. It's a delight. I've now bought three of those little tin Pokemon Go things. Yeah, they're great. Uh, I got one that has that has Pikachu on it. And I gave that to Helen, and she's just a, obsessed with anything Pikachu on it. And then Ben wanted one. He just was always taking hers. I'm like, <laughs> got him an Eevee one, and now he's excited to have a little Pikachu coin too. Yeah, I uh, I don't know when or if I'll get Nora into Pokemon cards at any point, but. Her, uh, she goes to a daycare, and her teacher at her daycare gave her one Pokemon card as like a gift. Hmm. Like brought one for all the kids, and everybody got one Pokemon card, and she chose Flaffy. I don't know if she chose Flaffy or if Flaffy was chosen for her, but that was the Pokemon she chose mm. or got brought home. I don't get so the growl is a steel type move costs one energy and I can't use it it's so weird I 
don't know. Do I have to have taken damage or something first? What was it? Is it your during, first oh, turn? Oh, during your opponent's next turn, the defending Pokemon's attacks do 20 less damage before applying weakness and resistance. Now you're definitely thinking of it right. I have no idea. Something definitely not adding up. Well, it's not like it would have dealt any damage anymore. It would have prevented some damage. But... I love that mill metal card. Actually, I've got that one IRL. Obviously, because I bought this deck. Right. <laughs> Evolution wakes you up. Apparently. No! Well, that's not too bad. Ooh. Search your deck for up to two basic energy cards and attach them to your Pokemon any way you like. Then shuffle your deck. Could have used this last game. Right? Yeah, clearly that would be a good one to throw in. To your custom build. That I just love Preserve. So. He's a good Pokemon. The uh, battle match game that they came out with. Um, the one that they're like pushing at McDonald's right now. Right. Uh, is very fun for Helen to play. And just in when she says she has like a passing interest in what Pokemon are. Um, it's been pretty good. Are you familiar with what that is? No, I can't say that I've heard of it. So when you buy the cards at... So they just released a, a home board game version of it that just comes with a bunch no. of cards and there's, it's basically high card. You set out one of your cards um, and then you spin a spinner and then it'll say like health, Pokemon height, Pokemon weight, uh, it's Pokemon number or the card number. And whoever has the two, the highest of those two will uh, will win the round or whatever. Yeah, and it's very simple for kids. They like to see the pictures. They can see the Pokemon. And so it's been a very easy thing for me to, to do with Helen every once in a while. And so I've just been going through as I get multiple duplicates of a bunch of different things. I was like, oh, she can have this card. She can have this one. So if it gets messed up, it's not that big of a deal. Right. Oh, my goodness. I cannot get inner, any inner, inner, inner energy. No. I'm just going to, have to keep taking it. No bueno. Have some Pokemon though. Yeah, what was that? The lore module? Yeah. Fun. Too bad it really only sort of helped. Oh, have some more one? Pokemon. Yeah. I don't have any basic, like, like, no basic Pokemon in my thing, and that really helped me out. Yeah. Didn't really help me. I actually didn't, didn't really help. <laughs> None of my evolutions were helped at all. But hopefully it at least freed up some energy and I'll get energy next round. That would be nice. Gotta say, I am liking this uh, Berserker card quite a bit. Yeah. Deal a buttload of damage, or hey, if I'm not going to take anything, let's, uh, let's beef up my other Pokemon real quick. Right. Like a call to arms Pokemon. Or a call to muster, if you will. Uh, especially whenever I'm in this situation. <laughs> but 
But at least you got a ton of Pokemon to choose from. I do have so many Pokemon, and I can play literally three of them. <laughs> I guess, I guess... Okay. I guess that's fine. this card for one energy. <laughs> that looks like I might be about to do that exact thing. Nope, I'm going to mute for just a second. Sarah's giving me a call. You are all good. Oh, man. This is a real bind I'm in here, folks. He does 80 damage, that would take me down to 50. Even if I had 20 health, I still wouldn't survive a second hit. That's real bad! I'm out of luck. I guess we'll do the energy retrieval. Kind of a waste of card. A little bit of a waste. Maybe Trumbeak can whittle him down a little bit. Survive one exact turn. Precisely one turn. I don't know, I think I'm losing this round. What had to a pretty quick turnaround. And I'm back. Welcome back. Thank you. I was just telling everyone that I'm pretty sure I've lost. Already. <laughs> well, I've got a, a pretty decent hand here. I think if, if I were if this berserker gets knocked out, I've got two more. If I were playing uh, against a bot, I would probably concede. But I'll play to the bitter end. Because it could take a turn. You never really know. Drumbeak might take it home, so. I'll don't lose hope. Not a chance. Good. Thank you for the double tails. Thank you. Oh. Thank you for the triple tails. Delightful. <laughs> it's pretty convenient to see your heads, huh? Feels good to see your heads. It, like now really you nice. just know how I felt last round. Right. Like, oh, look at all that energy, huh? You got the, the, some good energy? That is definitely the difference. You know, whenever whenever B Surfer was talking about the difference between Pokemon and Magic and that kind of thing. That's definitely the thing. Pokemon feels like it relies a lot on luck for some of its gimmicks, and you can absolutely lose around for no real reason. Mm -hmm. Whereas Magic feels a little more like you can just build an absolutely beat em up deck that nobody can take down. But you can do that kind of thing in this game in Yu-Gi-Oh, but it feels a little more based on luck. I have a friend of mine who's been trying to get me into Magic for so long, and I just oh, like, no, game. man, it's an expensive hobby, and it I can't do it. it and then here I am, like, stuff. spending money on Pokemon, and if he Pokemon. finds out, he's going to be very upset with me. <laughs> Pokemon also quite expensive. This is a silly thing to do, but I'm doing it anyway. Oh, wow. That This Mel Metal card feels a little broken. I didn't notice that the first one was attack and deal 50 damage. And then also, if you want, throw a steel energy on this card just to power it up. <laughs> yeah. Most of the V cards are pretty busted. Is Mel Metal not an evolution? Uh, because it's a basic V card, it gets to go right in. No, that's not what I'm saying. But yeah, Mel Metal. So there's Meltan and then the Mel Metal. My move is supposed to do 30 damage to Evolution, but because it's considered a basic. Ah, that's yeah. awful! That would be a 
that would be a house rule for me. I still would have taken you down, but that would have been a house rule. Right. For sure. No, I, I, I agree. That's kind of silly. Take it. Spend it, did it. Take it all the way to the bank. Oh, you got Decidueye? That's exactly what I mean by the luck thing. You need to get heads, you need to get tails. Mm -hmm. Actually, probably shouldn't have done that. Well, I lose anyway. Unless you stay confused. No. Nope. GG's. GG's indeed. Uh, what All time right. are you streaming until tonight? 9.30. 9.30. We so still got 20 minutes, so we could always do a tiebreaker here. I was going to say, we need, we need to at least do a tiebreaker. I'll try this uh, Mental Might deck now that I have in here. I don't know where it came from, but I've got it. The game sounds are way above you, says Fire Resistant. I'm ready for just the new game in general. I want all new game sounds. Oh, I turned oh, the, all like that stuff the volume down is way above me. I can crank it down. Yeah, it is very frustrating to me how some games are so much louder than others. I might just pick a random deck here. Volume, yes, it scared the crap out of me. Oh no, I'm sorry, fire resistant. Welcome to the stream. We're glad that you're here. How'd you find us? Are you a big PTC, PTCG O fan? I'm trying to decide what deck to do. For Helen, I'm gonna do a Pikachu deck. I've no, I don't know if I've ever used this deck. Nice. It's got a Pikachu on it, so I'll do it. Well, hopefully the volume is a little better now. A Christian streamer, so I go looking for other Christian streamers. Rock on! Nice. What do you stream? Yeah, what what kind of games do you stream, Fire Resistant? Oh, it's OG cards. Oh, I love this. Okay, cool. Oh, that's cool. It's going to be very hard to find energy in this deck, I have a feeling. Okay, a lot of, a lot of paralysis going on here. Hmm. No games. We do a talk show where we talk everything from wrestling to Jesus. Present and defend the gospel. Very cool. Yeah. Very, very cool. Welcome to the stream. We know tons of Christian streamers. We try and be a, a connexus, a big connection point between all these different... Christian streamers like Love Thy Nerd, Next Gen Ninja, and Methodist Gaming, and Crossfire Ga Faith Plus Gaming, and all sorts of folks. We do our best. I love seeing those old, old. I know they're so cool. That's so cool. Yeah, I'm so mad at myself for not keeping them. I am too. I mean, I I wasn't until like two weeks ago. <laughs> right. We're connected to all of them for the most part. Very cool. Well, then we've de we're definitely in the same circles. 
If all those names sounded familiar. I'm trying to get better about rating big Christian streamers and things like that, but sometimes it's easier than others. Very cool. There was just somebody else that I heard of today that just does kind of like a talk show thing. Man, the cards punch so much lighter. Um, I'd like to know who they are because most people just play games and zero gospel. Well, I think that a lot of it comes down to doing all that you do for the glory of God, right? We So our like most gospel-y times are like this morning we did our nerdy sermon talk back where we watch our nerdy sermon from the prior Sunday and work through those as kind of an opportunity to share a little bit more message. But most of our most of our um, game streams are really just to get to know people and hopefully welcome them to our Discord. I'm less focused on like evangelizing on Twitch and more focused on just getting to know people for the first time, you know. <laughs> These cards are real weak, dude. <laughs> Did you see what that is? It does 50 damage or I or I'm and I'm dead. Yeah, I had a couple of those like Voltorb is like that. 50 Unless damage. Can... That's no damage at all. I might as well <laughs> just like throw my card away. Mm -hmm. All right. <laughs> Maybe Magneton does something. And it's a build up to that. Maybe. But you can like highlight over my other cards down here too. Kakuna. Right? That's a second evolution. And the second evolution poison powder does 20 damage. And then you also flip a coin for the poisoning. 20 damage for two two counters. Oof. Oof. That's what I say. But yeah, I think it comes down to a different uh everybody has a little bit of a different of approach there, fire resistant. Our like Wednesday morning streams are probably our most gospely. Our Friday podcast, if we do them, we're typically talking to a minister, so that kind of thing turns into more of those conversations. We allow for it to be organic. Oh boy. Yeah, the Discord definitely feels more like where gospel yeah. would be. Yeah, that's where we have our church talk channel. We're currently having a really active conversation going over in church talk about um uh, the, the just the, the yeah the, not even politics like like American politics, but politics like church politics, like what goes on behind closed doors, the drama of, of those conversations. <laughs> oh, thank goodness I paralyzed you because I'm not going to do any damage to you for the next <laughs> a million rounds. I'm probably not going to hit you again. I also got to be totally honest for a um, a deck literally called Evolutions. Uh, not seeing a ton of evolutions out there. American politics have become idols. The yeah, they certainly have. Like I said, this one has more to do with like um, church. The church politics, like boards and councils and just the, the stressors of interpersonal relationships and that kind of political nature. The vying for political power within the actual institution of the local church. But I do agree with you.
Did Spectrum get us or is that my internet? Oh no. I think it's my internet. Uh, I, looks like I bailed out. Usually around this time, my internet just starts uh, getting real bad. I don't know if I can join in if I get if I reconnect or not. Oh no! Well, I would hate for us to lose this match. <laughs> I would hate to not be able to see this one through to the end. I'd be I'd be devastated to be honest. Anyone pursuing power needs to be removed. They aren't there oh, for no, ministry. They're there for ego. <laughs> yeah. I don't disagree with you, fire resistant, but it's sure. I feel like if we pursued that, then we wouldn't have anybody left. It feels like there's so many people that are there for ego. There's a strong. We are. We are. We are strong in our humanity. There. I'll concede. Did that respawn it looks like for I'm you? Trying to can reconnect. Maybe that'll disconnect it for you. I was able to log back in. There we go. Now I'm back in. But victory. Perfect. Three or more are gathered. That's right. Hopefully we can find three that don't want power. All right. All right, well, now that we're not doing that one, we can try one more. Let me look at this deck before I choose it. <sighs> if you've got time for one more. And, well, the, I think, and the wherewithal. I, I, yeah, I think I've got to have, I mean, we've only got 10 minutes. I don't know we would be able to get a full thing in, especially with my internet. So True. Uh, and Sarah's expecting me, so I, I do gotta run. But thank All you for playing. Good. It's nice to actually play against somebody who's not a computer. So right? anytime you want to play again, let me know. Absolutely, I would love man. To get deeper into the game. Well, it's real fun. I look forward to continuing to walk through it with you. Now I gotta get back into it. If they'll just Bring launch some the new cards one. To LTN count if you weren't already. Oh yeah, no, I've already got. I think What's Brian uh, from Maviga has demanded that I do that. So I'll okay. bring my cards. Cool, man. All right. Well, I'll All talk right. to you later. Thanks for having Deuces. me on the stream. Thanks for hanging out. All right. Well, now i got to figure out what to do. Do I want to keep exploring? What games do you play? I play a little bit of everything. We're a variety stream here. So we really just kind of play anything and everything that we're feeling. Currently, so tomorrow we're going to have a stream at 9 o'clock in the morning Eastern. We're going to finish up Islets, which is a new game... A new Metroidvania, a wholesome Metroidvania. I'm super excited to get back into that and hope maybe finish it tomorrow. We'll see. Uh, they It says it's like a six-hour game, and we got a couple hours in on Tuesday, but who knows. And then on Friday, we're actually airing a new podcast called the Level 2 Podcast where we're talking about uh, what is a nerd church? What does a church for nerds, geeks, and gamers even mean? And uh, what what's good about it? What's different about it? What's not different about it? What's stayed the same? How are we kind of feeding from our rich tradition while also innovating and um, utilizing the new platform of the internet? So, should be cool. Should be a good time. It's a good podcast. I've enjoyed. I enjoyed recording it with some of our level two peeps. Nice. But yeah, I'm a big fan of Pokemon. We have a whole day. Pokemon Days is just where we play Pokemon games. And um, I like cute games. I like story-driven games. Narrative games are definitely what I prefer most of all. If I can, I get I get behind a narrative-driven game. Those are my per personal preferences there. We got we got some good stuff on the backlog. I I signed up officially today for a how long to beat account because I thought it'd be kind of fun to keep track. Any games that I beat, I'll put how long to beat on there. So like an Omori, like I beat that game not too long ago. Neon White, Stray, Last Call, Inscription. I'll start adding adding games as I get them on there. That should be a good time. Yeah, we've got just a few minutes left. I'm real tired. So I might just honestly hop. Looks like Jay is live right now. Are you in the States? I am. I'm in North Carolina. That's where I'm based out of. I'm a United Methodist pastor, an official United Methodist church plant. out of Western North Carolina. Where are you based? In Texas. We have a couple conferences in Texas. I got a relationship with a North Texas conference. Oh man, everybody's live, huh? It is so weird. So we stream, um, Dallas, Fort Worth area, got you. We stream 
mostly during the afternoons. So Monday at one o'clock, Tuesdays at one o'clock, Wednesdays at nine o'clock in the morning and every other night like this, Thursdays at nine o'clock in the morning, and then Fridays, if we stream, we stream at two o'clock in the afternoon. So I never stream at night. And now I'm at night and it's like everybody's live. Oh, Crossfire's live. We should raid Crossfire probably. Yeah, we'll raid Crossfire podcast. Um, our fellow our fellow Methodists, Methodists out there. What side do you fall on with the forthcoming split? We're remaining Methodist. Um, we we are. I am. I am a Methodist through and through. What is the what's the old adage? Methodist born, Methodist bred, and when I die, I'll be Methodist dead. I think that's the thing. So that's how I feel about it. I think that the people that are splitting are doing exactly what we were just talking about, vying for power. Um, it's obviously more nuanced than that. I don't think everybody is doing that. That's that's splitting, but I think a pretty major aspect of it is is vying for power. So, yeah, it's definitely a it's definitely a money divorce, right? Money is always really ugly. Um, and as we're as we're figuring out what this separation and divorce looks like, that's been the biggest sore subject for me. Is like people talk too much about money. Uh, and it's it's a huge stressor in the church debate. So for me, I'm I'm willing. Yeah. So if you aren't familiar with the Methodist structure, Methodists are a big tent, which isn't how some people would like to refer to it. But we're a big tent. We're all connected um, over this thing called the General Conference. So the General Conference has all these various annual conferences. Um, there's also then the central jurisdiction. Well, technically, General Conference, jurisdictional level, conference level, uh, district level. So like I am in a district that then that district is in an annual conference. That annual conference is in a jurisdiction. That jurisdiction is within the general conference. And we all share these things called apportionments that, that fund a lot of that stuff. And then we also have local church donations. We have tithes. Um, we have stewardship campaigns. We have a lot of sources of things that come in. And then all of the buildings in the Methodist church are trusted to the Big Ten um, through our literal like trusting program. And so what's happening now is that people are fighting and they're feuding and they want to split and they're having difficulty discerning how to divvy up the building. Um, what do you do with a church building when technically the church doesn't own it? It's owned by the connection. That's a trick. That's troublesome. Uh, I, I think that we're going to find more and more of that in the evangelical sphere with like satellite churches. Like what happens whenever a satellite wants to split off, right? Like think of a Craig Rochelle, right? If, if, uh, if, if Craig Rochelle or even a Louis Giglio, if like a passion church or whatever, if one of those church campuses want to split off, like, like Craig Rochelle's not going to let them split off, right? It's, his, it's, it's that church corp building, which is nasty. It's disgusting. So that's the real like trouble is trying to figure out what it looks like. On one hand, I'm, I'm pro, like I'm a Methodist. On the other hand, I think that it's unfortunate that we're having to fight over something so physical and so money. Ugh. I, I get an uncomfy stomach about it. And so I would rather just live in the disagreement and in the body of Christ and know that we don't have to agree on everything to still love each other and stay in community with each other. And we don't really have a, a choice at the end of the day, right? We can't look at the foot and say, I have no need of you. Uh, we just have to, we have to deal and embrace and when necessary, core topic is LGBT. The money is the byproduct sort of, you're not wrong, but you're not exactly, it, it is more nuanced than just LGBT issues. That's definitely a part of it. Um, there's also uh, a bit of a crisis about elders versus deacons orders and why should we do certain things and uh, should we remain in the itineracy program should we guarantee pastors employment should it be more local church focused or should it be more of a broad church focused should it should we remain that umbrella there's a lot there's a lot we're feuding and fighting over um I honestly think that the LGBTQIA plus stuff is the easiest thing for people to grab onto because it's divisive in the larger culture. But there's so much more that's going on. Yeah, it's troublesome.
But at the end of the day, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to stay. I'm going to stay in the UMC, and I'm going to fight, and I'm going to love, and I'm going to embrace and hold the hand of my neighbor after it's been thoroughly washed with hand sanitizer and COVID tested and wearing a mask. But at the end of the day, I'm going to remain. Sucks because it hurts kingdom work. Absolutely. It tries to. Nothing's going to stop the kingdom of God. Nothing's going to stop it. Even an umbrella, even a big corp can't stop the the kingdom. Amen. (laughs) There we go. That's a note to end on. Neither, Neither death nor life, nor light nor darkness, nor heaven nor hell could ever come between. There we go. That's a good note to end on. All right, we're going to go raid Crossfire Podcast. God is bigger than our sin. That's right. We're going to go raid Crossfire Pod. Oh, nope, they're not live anymore. Ah, well, did they just finish up? Surely not. They're not done at 930. Are they done at 930? Thanks for the chat. Hey, absolutely, Fire Resistant. Thank you for hanging out with us. Maybe they have it turned off. I want to raid Crossfire. There they are. All right, we're going to write Crossfire Podcast. Folks, we believe three things to be true about every single one of you out there. Number one, we believe that God loves you. Number two, we love you. And number three, we believe that you, yes, you matter. You are a person of sacred worth. The world is a better place. Why? Because you are in it. Folks, with that, I have been Nerd Pastor Nate, the Nerd Pastor here of this church plant called Checkpoint Church. And we're going to go raid crossfire podcast where i believe russ is playing destiny 2 for the first time ever go spam some you matters in the chat and until the next time i see you which i hope will be over on our discord right now or maybe tomorrow morning nine o'clock in the morning to finish up islets with us nice to meet you fire resistance thanks for the follows i'm from all of our wonderful people new new friends that followed us and hung out with us uh but we're gonna go and give a good old-fashioned raid crossfire podcast appreciate the follow my friend thank you thank you and uh yeah Sounds good. Y'all enjoy the stream. Enjoy some Destiny 2. Tell Russ he's doing great and that he does indeed matter. Until next time, bye-bye!